What's up, everybody? It's Nick from MMA Pixels here with Ricky Big Sexy Galvez. How you doing, Ricky? Doing good, and yourself? Doing great, man. I know you got a big fight coming up May 19th for 5150 Fight Night 4 May, uh, in Livingston, California. I'm pretty excited about this card. There's yeah. uh, not only your your fight, but there's quite a bit of fights coming up on, on this card. I've seen it. It was pretty stacked. Yeah, it looks pretty stacked. I just saw it this morning so i got the what is this the, the contract i actually just signed the contract and sent it to the promoter right now so i was checking it out but yeah it looks like 14 15 fights i think yes yeah, hopefully they all make it i don't know probably yeah. end up with 12 or so right that's how it goes so uh your last matchup was super heavy actually all your matches have been at super heavyweight is this one too uh no this one's gonna be heavyweight yeah. Is there a reason there was uh, super heavyweight? Were you bigger? You're dropping down weight, or um, is it just the reason they were? Um, as I recall, my first fight, I guess the opponent he wanted to keep it at super heavy, didn't really want to cut, so I, I had like, yeah, I don't have to cut, so I'll keep it. And it was like the same thing with the last fight, but it's just like I've always tried to go to heavyweight, so this time I told myself it's going to be a heavyweight fight. So, will you have to cut any weight for this fight? Um, right now, I'm walking like 270. So I just have to cut five pounds, which should be nothing. Yeah. Right. Uh, how long was training camp for this fight? Uh, well, I just found out um, that I was going to have this fight um, officially yesterday. But um, I've been training. I train Monday through Saturday. And um, I've just been training. But my fight camp now is going to start. So it's going to be three weeks, four weeks. I just focused on it. Will you actually be training for your opponent, or does that not matter to you? Um, I All I know for my opponent is his name and his record. He's 0-0. I got no info on the guy, so it really doesn't matter to me. So I'm just going to do what I do and keep going on that. So your last fight was for uh, 5150, uh, yes. Fight Night 2. Do you enjoy fighting for this promotion? Um, they've been a good promotion. Um, I've fought in under two good promotions, 559 fights. And 5150 and 5150 they're real good professional. I enjoy them. So you have two amateur fights. How many are you looking to, until you turn pro, or are you looking to turn pro? Yeah, I'm, I'm looking to turn pro. I'm just going with whatever my coach says. He said he wants me to fight one-year amateur, and seeing once this year's up, we'll see if we're going to go to the next level if I'm ready for it. I just go with whatever he says. All right, who's your coach? Uh, Phil Collins. And uh, what team are you training with? Uh, team Payne. Under him. Quite a bit of names there. Um, recently, like uh, Ryan Williams has just won the title. Yeah. Who else are you training with out of there? Out of there, there's Chilo Gutierrez, Ryan Atterbury, um, well, Ryan Williams. And there's people that come and train with us at times, but the main team, that's just us right now. Who would be your uh, biggest supporter? My biggest supporter... Oof. I would say my mom, even though she doesn't like me fighting, she's always been there for me. Has That's she seen you? Fun. Has uh, she watched she, you? Fight? She actually hasn't. She um, she was um, she was in Mexico for my first fight, and my second fight, she was actually in the parking lot. She didn't want to get down, but she's seen the videos. She's like she cringes up, but yeah. Yeah, that's one of my good. big driving forces. That's awesome. Where can fans connect with you on uh, social media? I have a Instagram. My Instagram name is Ricky Tan. It's R I C K K Y T, four A's and an N. And um, on Snapchat, that's basically what I use. Yeah, Snapchat's the same name. Are you selling any tickets for this event? Um, I haven't gotten any information. Last time, 5150, they didn't provide tickets. I guess they just sell them online and at the door. Um, so, I, like I said, I haven't gotten any information on the tickets. I'm going to talk with the promoter in these upcoming days. So, I'll be able to see if I'm going to get tickets to sell or not. Right. I'm pretty sure they're using the same venue. Yeah. Yeah, this time they're going to have a cage, though. So, that's pretty exciting. Last time it was in a ring. Oh, really? Last time was a ring? How many yes. ropes? It was, I believe it was three. Three or, yeah. I don't remember. Well, 
Uh, any anybody fall out or anything? Any uh, issues like that? And well, in my in the fight around the second round, I had taken my opponent down, and we had kind of gotten close to the ring where they stopped it because I guess he was too under the the ropes, so they had to recenter us. But that was the only issue. You said you're looking forward to fighting in the cage. Yeah, enjoy the cage a lot more. So. Yeah, I think for a spectator though, I think the ring's better because you could see. But yeah. other than that, the cage, I don't know. Because you do have to stop the action if you don't want nobody falling out. Yeah, exactly. Right on. So, anything that we didn't cover that you'd like to talk about, man? Um, no, just um, if anyone could come support, watch the fight. Uh, it's in Livingston, California at the 5150 venue. It'll be my third fight. So, this time I'm looking for it to be a knockout. I've won the last two unanimous decisions. So, this one. I want to get it done, you know. Don't leave it in the judges' hands. Was there uh, any question, like waiting for for the decision? Did you did you kind of wonder if you did enough to win it? Um, no, like hands down, you know, they were all unanimous decisions. But I just gotta really work on my striking. That's what I've been working on. So, right on. I appreciate your time. I know you've been working hard training. May 19th, Livingston, California, 5150 Fight Night for Ricky Big Sexy, Big Sexy Galvez going down. Thank you, Ricky. Thank you.